Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the LG Tone Platinums. Now I've been getting a lot of requests to check these out and the number one question people been asking me is if you got some LG Tone Infiniums, the 900s or the 910s, are these worth the upgrade? And we're gonna find out right now. First up, let me show you the website real quick so you can see where to get them from. Go to Amazon.com. I'll throw the link up in the description. All right, so we got the LG Tone Platinums. Now the price on these, $164.99. So you're looking at $165. Let's check these out. Simple looking presentation. Let's go over the key features. You got Harman Kardon Platinum Sound. You got dual MEMS microphones, retractable earbuds, anodized brushed aluminum trim, hi-fi sound, and balanced armature speaker unit. Now some additional features, you got Talk and Tone, the SMS Reader app, we'll go over that in a minute. You got Qualcomm APTX HD compatible, which means you need a G5 to get the maximum sound out of these, but we'll test them with some other phones too and see the difference. This has multi-connection, you can pair up to two devices, and you also have auto reconnect. So once your battery dies or you turn your phone off, it'll connect back by itself. Let's check out some of the specs. Now music playtime, up to 10 hours, Talk time, up to 11 hours. Standby time, 17.3 days. That's crazy. The weight, 2.5 ounces. Bluetooth version, 4.1. Bluetooth profiles, blah, blah, blah. Uh, operating range, 33 feet. That's about standard. And the app is for iOS and Android downloads. All right, so let me grab a little unboxing knife, and we'll pop this open. Shout out to the little unboxing knife. Rah, rah. Here we go. Okay, little sleeve. Tone Platinum. Okay. Got something important. Whenever I see something important, I just immediately file it. <laughs> Savageness. Inside the box, here's your headphones. Let's see what else is on here. Okay, this is your LG tag. What is this? Let's see. Do not fold this tag or put on metallic objects. NFC tag. All right, that's kind of dope. We'll save that. Little box. Inside this box, here's your micro USB charging cable. Decent length on this. USB to micro USB. Of course, your usual books and shit. File these immediately and some different size earbuds. All right, pretty much simple and straightforward. Now for the headphones. Now these got a nice feel to them. You could definitely feel the difference in the build quality. That cold aluminum feel to it, I like that. On one side, here's your micro USB charging slot, okay? Here's your reverse tracks and skip tracks. It's a little toggle. You could change the settings on these using the app. We'll go over that too. Here's your play and pause button. On the other side, here's your call and uh, call and answer, <laughs> call, answer, and phone calls button. This is also a function button. You got another slider, okay? Battery, you could check your battery indications and you could also read your messages out loud. Some little HD branding, some Harman Kardon branding on it. And you got two buttons on the inside. Now these are for your retractable earbuds. And these go about four inches press the buttons and they slide back in. That's one of my favorite features from these LG headphones. And of course, your on and off switch. So we'll turn these on. And for the first test, I'm gonna use a Galaxy S7. Now for this, this will be for anybody who doesn't have a G5, we'll see how it sounds. So let me pair this up real quick. Okay, so the Tone Platinum's popped up. They all paired up. Now let's do a little sound test. Now I'm going to take it to some DJ Snake. This is one of my favorite test songs. Here we go. Max volume. Okay, going in. Some people want me. This is my joint right here. I should be happy. Y'all like that voice. Here we go. Wait for that bass drop. Woo! If they 
bring me down. Okay. Whew. <laughs> now, how do these sound? One thing I will tell you, you get more flexion on these than the previous LG ones. So if you got a big neck like me, that's a plus. Sound-wise, they pretty much sound the same as the Tone Infiniums. Not too much of a difference. Crystal clear, nice bass, nice highs and mids. But for the main sound test, we're gonna have to use the G5. All right, because if you wanna get the maximum quality from these headphones, you have to have a G5. That's the only phone that will uh, produce that sound. So now let me pair it up to the G5 and we'll see if there's a difference. All right, so we got it paired up to the G5. Now, as far as the pairing, real simple. Just like any other Bluetooth headset, go to your Bluetooth menu, scan it, and pair it right up. Now, here's the thing. If you got one phone connected already, the easiest way to pair the second one is turn it off, turn it back on, hold down the call button for two seconds, and that'll manually put it in pairing mode. Now, on a side note, I was playing around with this NFC sticker, and this is kind of dope. All you got to do is rest your phone that has NFC capabilities, and you can pair it like that. All right, so let's do a little sound test now using the G5, and we'll see if it's a major difference. So I'm going to go ahead and slap these in. We'll take it to the exact same song, max volume, and we'll see what it is. I'll give you out of words for this one, too. All right, here we go. Woo, already louder. Okay, it's definitely louder. I should be happy. Let's go. Here we go. Here we go. Bass drop. Woo! I'm not a follow-up. Yo, major difference. Woo! Let's go. Don't tell me what could be done. Here come that, here come that second bass drop. What you want, what you want to do? Here we go. Yo, all right, here we go. Okay, okay, okay. Fellas, ladies, whew, I'm back here partying. If you got a G5, you need this. <laughs> Simple and plain. Yo, shout out to my man, Sam. Now, I don't know which phone you was using to test these on. If you got a Galaxy or an iPhone or an HTC, Bluetooth pairing on this, it's going to work. And it's going to sound fine. It's going to sound like the other LG headsets. But if you got a G5, all right, if you got a G5, you want this headset. Now, the other ones you could get for less than a buck right now. These going to run you a buck sixty. On a scale of one to 10, buy these immediately. The sound difference is so major, major, night and day. Now, when I had this to the S7 Edge, it sounded crystal clear, it sounded good. When I paired it to the G5, that Qualcomm APTX, who knows what that means, but it works. I right? <laughs> just go Google and find out what that means, but it works, especially with this G5. This is a major win. This is gonna be my new headset now. I gotta retire the old ones. Now, one thing I will say, this one is definitely a little bit more comfortable for me. Because if you got your old ones, you notice they don't flex that much. They do have a little bit of flexion, but on these, major flexion. These are dope. Now, let's take it to the app real quick. You got the Tone and Talk app. Let's check out some of the features on this app real quick. Now, this is connected already, so you got vibration, uh, vibration notifications. Now you can select which apps you want to vibrate. I'll go through that later. You got voice notifications. You can select which apps you want to read your voice prompts. Voice, mem uh, voice memos. You can set this to hold down the button and take a quick voice memo. And you can also do some advanced settings. Let's see, headset settings of what we got here. Designated contacts, favorite contacts, and call logs. Play with all that stuff. You got your shortcuts. Now that's what we were just talking about. You can hold this button down to take a voice memo or just hear the current time. I'll use it for memo. And you got your voice prompt language. Let's see what language is on deck. I right, had only four languages. And you got a controls guide. 
All right, so basic app. If you had any LG headphones, you're familiar with that app already. Back to the sound. On a scale of one to 10, the sound quality is 100% noticeable. Now, a lot of times you get an upgraded set of headphones and they just sound a little bit better or basically the same, just with a better build. If you got a G5, you're gonna notice the sound is night and day. Now, if you don't have a G5, why would you buy these? Well, you get a better build on these. That aluminum, is it, these look, they, to me, they just look a little bit better. These are all plastic. You got that aluminum, and like I said, these flex a little bit more. Now, that could be a good or bad thing. A lot of people rock these in the gym, but these will slide right off your neck if you're doing that bench press or you're doing something inverted. You know, you're doing those, those ab crushers. These are gonna slide off. So I don't really use these in the gym. I use these really to talk on the phone and I'll tuck these inside of my shirt. As far as style, I don't know. A lot of people don't like how these look. Look like some um, <laughs> some space age type shit. What was the name of that movie? Um, the Arnold Schwarzenegger, The Running Man. This is like something from The Running Man. Remember they had this around your neck? And if you go if you go past the lines, they press the button and blow your head off. That's what a lot of people think these look like. Personally, when I wear these, I tuck them inside of my shirt so you really can't see them. Now, as far as call quality, let's do a little test phone call. Why not? I'll do a little test phone call and see how they sound. But, you know, these are headphones. They pretty much going to sound good. But we'll see. Why not? Let's put it to the test. Who can we troll real quick? Let's call the diner. All right, so I got a new diner to troll. I don't want to call my regular diner. Let's try Atlantic Diner. Yeah, hi, I wanted to find out if you guys are 24 hours today. Okay, great, thanks a lot. Okay, call quality sounds, sounds just like any other headset, sounds good. But back to the music, oh my God. 170 bucks on these, totally worth it. Now I can retire my other LG headphones with confidence and rock these. Anyway, hit me up in the comments, let me know what y'all think about these. Or let me know if y'all got any questions, comments, or concerns, and I'll try to get back to y'all. Shout out to everybody that rock with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rock with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, stream gangsters still on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat, Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad, I see y'all in the comments section early, hashtag salute. And shout out to my man Sam, like I said, yo Sam, I don't know what phone you're using, but you gotta get a G5 and try that test again, the sound is night and day. These are a total win right here. Oh yeah, one more thing, fellas. Ladies, say it with me, all y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Captain, energize.